What is up, guys? Welcome back to Creative Readers, etc. I'm Lexi, and this is me, Papa. Dad, hi. And today we're going to be painting Bob Ross. Uh, Maddie and Cassandra and I did this one time. We'll come back when our canvases are primed with liquid white and get started. A little too much brush today. I'm going to tack a little bit of Indian yellow into it. Don't need a lot of color. Something about like so. This way from here. I'm going to a little bit of cat yellow. I'm cleaning my brush. I didn't clean it after the white. You got to beat the devil out of it. So you, you, didn't, you didn't tell me to clean it after the white. I'm not Bob Ross. I got us a little bucket so that we can beat the devil. I didn't put enough in here. This is not good. Okay, so he's like kind of in the middle top of his uh -oh. camera. I'm a failure. <laughs> Oops. Well, you're not using that brush. That brush has died. This is where we're at so far. So far. I don't think there's much blending actually going on at all. Candy. That's you that's splattering my painting. It's ruined. I had a museum masterpiece going and you yacked on it. Make it clouds. <laughs> Happy accidents. <laughs> I, got, I got asteroids coming down and burning it. That's why it looks like it's a desert. Acid rain. This isn't a peaceful painting. This is, this is the apocalypse. That's why it's red. I don't think the liquid white is doing its job enough because it's not blending very well. Oh God, please. No, Bob, chill. What a magnificent person to view this. Stop. I gave you a devil beating bucket. Beat the devil out of it. And add grass. Are you not adding any more grass? My whole hills are grassed. No, oh, that's a lot of grass. Give me this little house there. We'll just create this out of basic shape. I don't want to build a house. Like so, I want it right in front of these trees. I'm not building a house, Bob. We'll take a little Van Dyke with This nature together. is going to be untouched by man. My house got destroyed. My house This is just a happy little house up here on the hill. No, I refuse. Texture blue. And then we're gonna take our paint tube and indicate a trunk. Then I'm gonna dry it off and use the red to highlight. Oh god, that's too much highlight. Maybe we should have experimented with the oil paints before doing this so we can figure out how to use them. Too late. Oh well. My big blob is a big blob. Because people who come just seem to be some of the nicest people. You're the nicest people, Bob. You're going on impressionism of Bob Ross. I turned a happy accident into something. Ah! Oh, now you paused the first time. Wow. The sun's up here. It's in the middle. Just to make a little sparkle on the side there. You don't like what I turned it into? You should have splattered on it in the first place. Go back to it. The brush has got the sap green and all the yellows on it. 
I'm gonna add it. some little highlights into my pattern. Baby, baby tree, 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 baby tree, 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 yeah. baby okay. tree. Here's the finished product. This is my rendition of Bob Ross. Is season 30, episode 12, Evening Glow. I think it came out pretty good. I'd give it a 7 out of 10. This is my rained on edition of Bob Ross's Evening Glow. That got splattered on, so I had to turn acid rain at least into a heavy rain. I'd give it a 3 out of 10. <laughs> and that does it. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment and all that fun stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. It's ruined. I had a museum masterpiece going and you yacked on it. Make it clouds. <laughs> Happy accidents. Okay.